What are you lot saying? It's your boy the Taurus Tamer. Welcome back to episode 8 of the Pokemon Coral Nuzlocke. Hope you guys are all doing well. Be prepared to sit back and chill and enjoy some more Coral goodness. As always, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. At 250 subs, we're going to rerun the Sapphire Sleep Lock. Go and follow the Twitch at 50 followers on Twitch. We're going to do Just Dance, and that's going to be brilliant. But yes, welcome back to my sand pit. We are here. Now, in the last episode, we got rinsed. We got ruined, and it was all my fault. I was being stupid. I'm too liberal with the speed up, because the speed up on this emulator is nuts. It's not like the other one where it goes at a slower pace, I feel, so I can actually recognize what's going on but it's my error for using the speed up but i resurrected three mons and grinded them up i thought well i'm not just going to start over actually i've also got a mon that isn't dead so i should probably should probably have put them on the team i'll go and do that in a moment but first we got cub i'll tell you level 25 scratch faint attack leer fury attack he's still about then we went and evolved mario to a level 25 gyarados with twist attack or bite and leer and last but by no means least we got Stoner, our Graveler, now, it was now our Graveler, level 25 with Tackle, Rock Throw, Roller, and Magnitude. Let's go. So we did, we did decent. We did decent. Decent little bit of grinding. Hopefully we don't come up under any BS. Now, I'm sure I have a Benary. Um, withdraw. Yeah, Tweety's dead, Spike's dead, Egg Eggie's dead, and Anakin, and X-Wing are dead. So, I'm going to take out the Veneri. Why not? I should have done that while I was grinding, to be fair. But we'll just use it as fodder if we need it, I guess, for now. So, I'm actually just going to make a quick cut. I wanted to do my usual instructions, but I'll come back to you when we are at the top of the peak where we were, where that trainer kicked our asses. Now, hopefully nothing goes wrong this time. I will see you there, my boys. 12 seconds later. Okay, boys, here we are. Down, right down there is the boy who ruined my fun. And, uh... Now this bitch is going to pay. I hope. Let's see how this goes, Jesus Christ. If you made it up this high, you must be quite the trainer. Shut up. Shut up. We don't like you. You're a dick. You are a dick. But yeah, also guys, make sure you go down below and follow my Twitter. Answer the question of the day. Today's video will be... What should we... What should we... What's your favourite of the legendary dogs? I'm going to have to say Suicune. You used to love Entei when I was younger because of the movie, obviously. You self-destruct, fam. I will go nuts. I will go nuts. See, now I'm a Graveler. I should outspeed everything. I mean, self-destruct, you're not even... Actually, it's a normal type move, so you're not even going to be able to do anything. So we'll do the Rock Throw. Then we're going to go with Magnitude. We should outspeed that Geodude who wiped us out. And we should all be good from there. He's only got three months. There we go. Here comes a Geodude that killed us. How did I lose a lock to a fucking Geodude? Of all the Mons... Of all the Mons, I was playing so dumb. There we go. Down goes the Geo dude. Dude, Geo, Geo, dude. I like Geo, dude. Pretty cool. Apart from the fact that he killed me, but okay, Zubat. But yeah, I hope you thought this was fair. I mean, I revived three of my Mons. I didn't want to bring back the whole squad. Of obviously, I've got to got to continue the game. I ain't gonna be able to continue the game with just the Benary because I ain't gonna be able to get past the Geo dude. So, yeah, this is what we got. But yeah. Hopefully you guys are having a fantastic weekend. And the next episode of Great Boys, I've got some BS to show you. It's not even like BS me losing. It's just BS with what the game wanted me to do. It was nuts. It was actually nuts. So I'm excited for you guys to see that. We will magnitude this boy. We know he's going to die. There we go. What have you got, Missy Trainer? What are you saying, girl? The air up here is a lot thinner. It's a great place to train. Let's do it. Let's train. Cool trainer Casey. Send out a Numal. I mean, I can just magnitude... Magnitude, oh, 10 as well. Big old damage. Big old damage. We know it's going to be dead in one. And Stoner will get another level. Let's go. But yeah, we should be coming to the end of this game. So I also want you guys to know, what ROM hack do you want to see me play next into a series? So I could do Kaizo. Uh, not Kaizo, that's the hard one. Karosu, which is a continuation of the Outlaw. Um, of the Outlaw story, I guess. We could do, well, anything. Just you guys... Have a look and let me know what you think. Right, what we got here? Okay, just another zoom out. Let's rock throw. I'm going to keep Stoner out in front. It's really hard juggling work, responsibilities, and the Pokemon training. It gets exhausting pretty quickly. I know the one, man. It's hard to balance, like, my work, seeing my girlfriend, seeing the fam, being with my friends, and also doing Pokemon stuff. But I make it work. I will always make it work. There we go. Kadabra. Kadabra. You ain't going to be able to do whack to me. 
No, you're going to die to that magnitude. Let's go. Lots of levels for Stoner. I'm going to put, put Mario in the front. Let's see what Mario can do out here. Let's go. Unfortunately, he doesn't quite have a water type move yet. So hopefully we get one soon. Let's go this way. I didn't mean to twist her, but fine. Fine. Um, what we got? What we got? That looks okay. That one. Slugma. A freaking slugma. Get in the bin. Get in the bin. Get away, Numo. Right, let's battle this guy. My Pokemon is always hungry. Like trainer, like Pokemon. I see what you did there. What you got for me, Mr. Hiker? A lava tararar. You're not dark yet. You could rock throw, I guess. Are you going to rock throw? Oh, you flinch anyway. Nice. Nice. But yeah, also make sure you join the Discord, boys. Come part of the fam. Join the team. And um, yeah, we should be doing a, ta uh, a tournament, another tournament next week. Our National Dex Anything Goes tourney. We should be good. If you want to hop in on that, jump on the Discord. The more people you are, the bigger the tourney. The more fun we have. But yes, it's all good, good business. We love to see it. Da -da -da -da. Oh, speaking of, we love to see it. Also, merch coming soon, maybe? Maybe I'm going to have some merch? I don't know. But it looks sick. From the design that I've seen so far, Emma, as always, let's draw if you don't know. My girlfriend puts in a madness of a grind and she smashed it. I've cut this tree. So I need to go get this island passed so I can get allowed onto the, this island. Mount Onway is massive though. Jesus. Daybait Grotto. Is this a new area? Does it tell me where I've caught my mons? I don't think it does in this gen. No, it doesn't. I'm not going to risk it. I don't want to run around with a mon that's uh, not legal. Oh no, we did come... No. Okay, Route 2. We've definitely been... Oh, yes, yes, yes. This was this side. I remember it all now. Back here. Back where we lost Picky Peck. Like, at the first obstacle, we lost a Mon. You love to see it. This is what you guys tune in to see my shit for. Okay, Daybreak Village. We don't want to go here. We want to go back to see our Madre. Mother, mother, mother. Where are you? No, up. Yes. Here we are. Back at home. Look at this city. Though. I love all the colour in this game. This is probably the most prettiest looking rum hack I've ever seen. Mumsy. Mumsy. Tamer. How's your adventure going? I've got that island pass right here. Let's go. And next episode. Well, no. This episode. Because we've only been. We've probably, we're probably only about seven or eight minutes through. But now I've got to go back through that mountain. Longest. Longest. You know what? I'll cut all that shit out. And we'll see you when we're at the other side. Okay, some rocket boy was here that I didn't know, so we're back into it now, boys. Roger. Heading to the island now. So we're, that's where we are off to, Sunbeam Island. So I wonder what's going to be there for us. Should be should be pretty exciting, pretty fun. Hopefully there's another gym we could do, maybe. I'm sure we should have the levels by now. We're level 25, coming up for 30. So we should all be good. Now, where's that bit? There's that bridge. It's down here. Here we are, boys. Sunbeam Island. Get ready to meet Mr. Tamer. Here we go. Excuse me. You can't come onto the island without an island pass. Flash the island pass. What? You have an island pass? Well, I guess I have no choice but to let you onto the island. Enjoy your visit to Sunbeam Island. Grumbling, grumbling. Here we are, though, boys. Sunbeam Island. A shining spot in the endless sea. Sounds pretty. Look at all these trees. Those tree sprites look mad. I hear Corsola are sometimes known to gather near the docks on the west side of the island. I bet this guy's favourite Pokemon was Corsola. Or Corsola, I always say it wrong. Lately, my Meowth has been acting out a lot more. I wonder if he's getting close to evolving. You never know. What else we got in here, though? The Mar... Okay, the standard business. Look at all these trees, though, man. Some of you know for its bright sunshine and deep blue waters. There's really no place like it in all of Onwa. Let's go. It looks lit. It looks lit out here. Spruce Pokemon Lab. Yes, because the guy wanted me to go there. We'll check out all the other business, and I'll cut back if there's anything exciting. Okay, so as I was exploring, this dialogue just popped up. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for. Okay, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we saying? And the winner of the Beach Battle Beauty Contest is... 
Leilani! Leilani, I think this is the gym leader. Someone mentioned her name. Here we go. Thank you so much, everyone. Not much of a crowd, is it? Well, folks, that's all for today. Join us next time for another fierce competition. Alright, what's up, chick? Thanks for coming out to the show. I'm Leilani. Leilani? I'm the gym leader of Sunbeam Island, and I guess I'm the latest beach battle beauty. And you are? Tamer? Well, you should come by sometime and have a battle. The gym on the island is in the jungle, so you can't miss it. I'll see you around. In a bit, gal. In a bit, gal, gal. Hope you are enjoying your shit. Look at that water as well. That is proper blue, isn't it? No one's lying there. Sunbeam Surf Shop. Surf's up. Oh, let's have a little explore. What's, what's this guy saying? You look mysterious. Leave me alone, kid. Come talk to me in the next release. Okay. I mean, hopefully the next release is soon. If the game does get updated, we will come back to it. But I, I do, do think we are close to the end. So I do need rum hack suggestions. Maybe I'll do a poll on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter. You'll love to see it. What we got over this side? Do do. What's over here? So much to see on this island. I don't have a Pokemon. Sometimes I think I should get one for protection. What if someone wanted to break in? I mean, just make sure it's not a Togepi like the last place I had to save. The water is calm. A Pokemon might be able to ride across. Sunbeam Island Boathouse. Ooh. Are you going to... Sorry, kid. No boats are running for now. Yeah, that's probably going to be a next update sort of thing. Well, that appears to be Sunbeam Island. Now, did a lot of good, good exploring. Do I end it off here? Probably not. I think it'll be a little bit too short. So we'll go into the lab and see what the Donny Professor man is saying. I mean, he's probably going to be going battle the gym. Yeah, safe. Um, do we have a rod? Potentially, we could get an encounter. We have a good rod. Jart will... Oh, actually. Grass. Can we go in there? This is the lab. So let's go in there first. Professor Spruce. Ah, you must be Tamer. I'm so glad you made it. How was the Pokemon I sent for you? Well, I hope. Actually, is dead. <laughs> anyway, let me show you around. Follow me. Let's go. Oh, little Munchlax. We'll start outside with the Pokemon habitats. After you. Okay. Oh, wow. My research involves Pokemon conservation. As such, I run a Pokemon reserve. We've got Don Fan. The Pokemon here are all very docile. Don Fan, Dodrio. Meow. Nice. Dodrio, Nidoran. Not quite sure what that one is. Is that a Nida Queen? I let, the live, I let the Pokemon live the lives that they would in the wild and study their behaviors. How are the young Nita Quinn? Yeah, they're good. She's she's gassed. We've got an Altaria, a Larpunny. Recently I experimented with letting trainers catch some of the Pokemon in the habitat to see how they react to being trained. Feel free to catch it for yourself. Okay, so this will be I can take my encounter here for Sunbeam instead of the ocean. Yeah, I'd rather do that because we've already got a Gyarados. Well, that's about it. Oh! I almost forgot to introduce you to my assistant. Now where could he be? I'm assuming it's the Munchlax. Ah, there he is. Yeah, it's the boy Munchlax. Haha, <laughs> seems like he's falling asleep again. I have just the thing. Please wait here a moment. Do you have a Poke Flute? Are you going to give me the Poke Flute so I can go get that damn Snorlax? Hmm, I can't seem to find what I'm looking for. Well, there's no need for you to wait around here while I look for it. Why don't you go have a look around the rest of the island? Just come back in a while and I'll introduce you to my friend here. Okay, well, what we'll do is we'll get an encounter and then we'll end it off here. And that'll be this episode. So let's see what we've got in Sunbeam Island encounter. I'm pretty sure I have balls. I'm certain I have balls. And that is lit because I have the TM for Thunder Punch and for Ice Punch. You, my friend, Elikid, or whatever I'm going to call you, you are going to be straight on the team. You will have an electric move and that will hurt. Let's go and, let's go and a Cub. Cub will be neutral. It won't do too much to me. He's raising his for death. We'll lick, see if we can para. He's got light screen as well. That's damn good. Para? Okay, no, we'll lick again. He thunder punches. Cub can take it. Cub can take that all day long. Can't wait to have an earth ring. Uh, thank you to uh, Mr. SSB, as always, for letting me know the things that I don't. Um, Cub will evolve into an earth ring, apparently at level 30. So that should be something exciting to look forward to. Now, let's try for a ball. I don't know if we've got any greats. I know I bought Pokeballs, but... Okay, I've got 33 Pokeballs and one Great Ball. So we're getting this thing. Let's see. First ball. Come on. Stay with me, you bitch. 
Please. Okay, I shouldn't be calling him a bitch. He's a bloke. I'm gonna call you Buddy. Call you Buddy? That's actually a cool nickname. My little buddy. I loved I I can't remember whether it was a movie or whether like there was like Ella Kids. It was like when they first introduced like baby Pokemon and they were all in this tree and there was like an ex uh, an execute as well. And I remember the Ooh, rippers. I remember the execute really well. Right, let's relax. Super potion. Up the boy. Yeah, I'm on the right one. Done the punch with super potion again. Okay, we can afford to throw a ball. I'm gonna go with again another Pokeball. Come with me, other kid, please. I need you on my team. I need more Pokemons. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh, fuck. I was just about to celebrate. You can hear it in my voice. That you. Okay, you're leering me. Ganastoda. You ain't gonna be able to do nothing to me. So I'm gonna just speed up, ball. Speed up, ball. Okay. No, apparently not. They really didn't like that one. Thunder Punch can do nothing. We'll go for another speed up ball. Three, two, one, and speed up. Man, this trick, I want to find my own trick, and this does not appear to be the one. Okay, ready, set, speed up. Man, you suck. I'm going to just, there we go, there we go. Elekid is here. Elekid is with us. He already knows Thunder Punch as well, so I need that, I can keep that TM. It loves violent thunder. The space between its horns flickers bluish white when it's charging energy. Giving an end to the other kid. Yes, please. I'm going to call you Buddy. I kind of like that name. Switch into Buddy. That sounds lit. Okay, Buddy is on the squad. And I think that is the perfect, perfect way to end the video. So we're, the rebuilding process has begun. That's all I'm going to say. I'm going to grind him up briefly and maybe grind up an area a little. And that should be all good. So... Excuse me a little, but it can't be a Taurus Tamer video without me burping at least once. But I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you guys on the next video. Take it easy, stay safe. I'll see you soon. Pa 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 peace.